Hi guys, this is Skidflash here, and welcome back to Let's Play Mother 3. Now in the last part, we beat the- we pulled the needle, that was the most important thing. Now we fought some mole crickets, and- <laughs> Oh god, they just ate that guy alive, that is creepy. Alrighty then. And, um, now we're going through the mole cricket maze, now on sale. Made fresh daily. Um, sincerity dumplings, okay. What are some sincerity dumplings? Yeah, sure, why not? How much do they cost? How much does sincerity cost? Um, one, oh, damn, that's pretty good, actually. I think. I don't remember. I don't. I, I, I can't. T I couldn't tell you that, actually. Well, whatever. We bought two. Um, even their holes are yum. That's nice. Do you, do you gain pleasure in the fact that knowing you just eat them alive? Um, well, we're very humble. Okay. I'd imagine you are. <laughs> I am the mo. I, I am humble pretty. I'm humble pretty. I'm like the most modest person you would ever meet. <laughs> Absolutely. Um,. So what do you guys have to say? An un un unbelievably accurate yet unhelpful map. Okay. Really? And why is it unhelpful? I see. So I think we have to go over there. That's where we're going. I mean, we could use this map to just tell us where to go. Well, that's like a lot of work, man. Um, You're going to be bored fast if you do, do point pointless chit-chat, but I I'm waiting for that one insightful hint. Um... You seem insightful, because you're- no, you're- you're mole cricket frogs. Oh, really? That's funny. Um, wait, can we save your game? I'm so happy you believed me. <laughs> oh, wow, cool. So we can save- <laughs> he, like, corrupts our save data. That would be so funny. That'd be a really dick, but that'd be really funny. Um, so I'm sorry, man, but we're gonna eat you alive. <laughs> oh, they make the face, too. That's just so bad. That's so bad. Okay, so then, is anyone gonna tell me? Um, so if there's a turn, turn, even if you don't want to. Okay, so that's how you do it. Do not go straight ahead, always turn. So that's the rule. Um, and it's somehow awesomely decided, awesomely designed to the point where if you turn, you'll eventually, you'll make it. So just keep on turning, just always. Always, if you see a turn, always turn. Um, I'm not exactly sure. Yeah, it's like like, like this. I don't know. That really doesn't matter. That is inconsequential. We didn't have to turn if we didn't want to. But, you know, it's best to just follow these rules. There's probably a way to do this even faster if you actually know your way around. But I certainly do not, so I'm just gonna... I'm just going to abide by these turning rules and hope we are going the way in which we need to go. Because I, I I believe I believe in the turning. I'm I'm a, I'm a follower of of the turn. What I was gonna say is there's there's no like three way turns. There's no forks, so that's nice. I mean there is forks. I I guess they would be forks, but there's no like three. You're you're never gonna have to like have two directions in which you can turn. So that's nice. That's 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 cool in that regard. And we're going in here. Are we there yet? I don't know how much longer we have to be doing this. But, uh, you just gotta have faith. I know, like, I know every time I do this, like, there's always in the back of your mind you're thinking, like, oh man, I'm like, what if I took the wrong not turn? <laughs> and then I, and I, I didn't turn when I, I didn't turn when I meant to turn. And then, you never know, but just, just believe in yourself. Believe in the turns. I think, yeah, see? This looks, this looks correct. This looks absolutely correct. Um, we didn't even have to turn there. But again, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I, I want to say there'd probably be a faster way of doing this. Or maybe there wasn't. Who knows? Um, so let's just keep pressing forward, because I, I think we're out of here. Yeah, so you're like, what do you do? What do you do now? You have to think for yourself? I can't do that. That's too, that's too difficult, man. Um, there we go. So it looks like we're out of the woods. This looks safe. Yes, we are. Now, is there a duster to be found? Because that's what I would really need. Are we in the sky right now? How did how did how does the how, how does a mole cricket do that? No, it's just I'm I'm assuming it's just super bright that um. Oh, we're in the snow. Okay, that makes more sense. Yes, we're in a snowy mountain. I think. Okay, I can believe that. Oh, there's a snowman. Let's take his nose. Um, <laughs> can we? Welcome. Okay, that's nice. Thank you, snowman. You're not gonna give me a piece of you though. We're gonna instead we're gonna be um, fighting the ten yeti. I <laughs> okay. Not really getting the uh, the joke there, but whatever. 
weak against fire because everything in this light in every everything in this mountain probably is um but how much health do they have is the real question more than one turn of health that's that's too bad or maybe they don't huh oh wait you know what I have gloves for you Kumatora why are you still alive that's the important part um cool I didn't have to use any more PP than that awesome awesome indeed you're now level 30 cool I want to give you those gloves though oh wait yeah no I do want to give you those gloves I thought I didn't want to give you those gloves but um it's it's duster that I don't really want to give any more stuff to because he has that awesome weaponry already now where is it I don't see it anyway it might be with uh, bony actually magic gloves give to Kumatora and they even increase her they increase something of hers so that's nice um yeah, maximum PP and offense, okay. Not not really magic or IQ, but still nice, still nice either way. Cool, you know what? I, I don't wanna I <laughs> I don't exactly wanna deal with these guys. So let's just do that. I didn't think um PK fire was actually I, I knew it hit multiple people, but I only thought it hit people in a row. I think it actually just hits everyone in this game. That might be mother uh that might be mother two or earthbound I'm thinking of where it only hits like a row of people well that's fine um, cause we can just drop all the magic we need to because you know you, you you obviously know double jerky holy shit but you obviously know that in a snowy mountain like this you are bound to find hot springs that's just that's just a rule um damage to all enemies okay yeah I guess so I'm not going to be able to combo anytime soon, though. That is the unfortunate truth. I wonder how much, um... I wonder how much... How much damage... Uh, normal... Normal fire does. Because if it's less than... If, if, if it's half, then it makes sense to use Veda. But if it's not less than... If it's more than half, then I might, I might be thrifty. Because, you know, why not? Um, it's so hard to... Snowman, what's up? Lydia is a very kind person. We snowmen love Lydia. Okay, that's nice. This is what happens when you speed up <laughs> Mother 3 battles. I, I, Lucas just died and I had no idea that he died because things were just going way too fast. Um, that's fine. We are using, we are also consuming PP like a madman. It's, 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 we're, um, cancer bracelet, okay. Before, let's, let's equip something because we are in fact dying. Um, you have nothing on your head still. Why, why is that? Who has the cancer bracelet? Um. Who has who has the worst bracelet? I guess. Yeah. Okay. We can stick that with you. We don't. We we don't want. You, I mean, we don't want Lucas dying either. But I I have somehow I have more faith in Lucas staying alive than Kumatora. Maybe I don't know if that's unfounded or not. But whatever. Yeah. See, we're already out of PP because I've been I've been I've been going a bit too hard on the uh, on the love. I guess I need to I need to. Uh, I need to conserve my love, I suppose. But yeah, let's let's. I I I guess I'm I'm already talking, so I had to talk through these frozen dogs or whatever the hell these things are. The chili dog. That's actually pretty funny. I didn't notice that. <laughs> um. Da, 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 da. Okay. Cool. Are you dead? Yes, you are. Awesome. Yay! Hooray! Happy day. Um, and a thousand and one experience points, man. These are finally giving more than those, uh, those one guys, but more Yeti on snowboard. I, I, I need to fight them. I do kind of feel, I'm feeling a bit underleveled right now, so let's just fight them. Okay, so pressing onwards, what do you have to say, snowman? Welcome to Snowcat Mountain. I'm the snowman that Lydia made. Okay, I guess Lydia has created conscious snowmans into the world. Oh, hey there, look at this. Um, let's just deposit some stuff because we have too much stuff. Enemy bufferizer. You know, I'll save this for a rainy day where that would probably be really, really useful. Um, greasy junk food. Uh, what do I want to... I don't even know what I want to actually... Can, yeah, let's do this nut bread. We don't need this nut bread. You know, we're actually more... We don't, we need to, we don't need to waste our time thinking about this. Um, a save frog though. I have a feeling we're going to be... Um... When snowmen melt away without ever meeting anyone. Wait, what did you say? Something sad, no doubt. From the moment they're made, snowmen wait for someone. Some snowmen melt away without ever meeting anyone. Damn. Um, so let's save. So one thing I do like about Chapter 7 is you think like, Oh man, like these seven, 
these seven MacGuffins we're gonna have to be hunting out. That's like so much work, but like, on, we're actually really close to another, um, we're really close to another needle, if I'm not mistaken. So the needles, the needles go by really, really quickly, so you don't have to worry about like, being on this chapter. I mean, it is a long chapter, but you're not gonna be here for absolutely forever. It's like, one dungeon, you're immediately at the, the next dungeon. There's no filler, which I like. Some, some RPGs are really horrible about that, about having like, just filler between things, like MacGuffin things that like, you feel are just so useless. Um, somewhat more cricket. Oh, okay, cool. We're gonna be fine. We have no money. Just gonna throw that out there. Strong against ice. Ooh, that would probably be useful for the fight that is no doubt coming up that is gonna take ice. And look at all these awesome things. Look, secret herbs. Okay, you are now the coolest, um, the coolest shop. However, you're gone now. So that's, oh, so he's here. So if you need to do some mole cricket shopping, right here is the way to go. And I might just do that off screen, perhaps? Who knows, after I feel alive again. <laughs> Something about Boney in the, in the hot spring is actually really funny. I just, just looked at that now. I don't remember, I don't remember this guy actually. Was he here during that tea party? I, I, I certainly don't remember him if that's the case. Um. He hasn't had vitters in some time. Okay, cool. Doesn't look like he remembers me. Where's the needle, though? That's the important thing. Actually, you know what? Off screen, I'm going to be doing some shopping, so I'll meet you back after I do that. Okay, I did. I did a minimal amount of shopping. I realized that I have no money, so uh, <laughs> I might have actually lost a good amount of money from dying to the uh, person. So that's not good. Oh, whoa! What are you doing here? Um, not as ply as fluffy bed. This pig mask person. Um. What's up with him? Did you take him in? I found him lying unconscious outside my house. He looks like he went on a scouting mission and got separated from his friends. Oh, that's so sad. You're helping the enemy, so that means you're like kind and like show compassion to everyone or something along those lines. I've heard about you from Ionia. I don't remember meeting you though. See, that's the thing. Okay, I'm Olydia, the magic the mad gypsy of Snowcat Mountain. Okay, that's nice. What you seek is behind the house, awesome, cool. That was quick. See how quick and painless that was? My gosh. Um, who cares? But this is one concern I have. Who will take care of my precious bunnies once I'm gone? Oh no, that is so sad. Will you step up to the task, man? And then there's him. He hasn't regained his strength yet. That's not good. Um, okay, well that's nice. Uh, that The bunnies, very, very sad, but we gotta pull this needle, man. Um, no, he's going out there, okay. Oh, no, he's not going out there. He's just going to lo unlock the door so we can go out there ourselves. Uh, oh, no, that's the sound of light motifs. Um, uh-huh, seems like something, something's out there. Uh-oh, okay, we gonna, we gonna figure out what that is? Oh, no, was he a spy? Was he? No, maybe I should, probably should have seen what you had to say. Too late for nap now. <laughs> You know what else it's also too late for? Is pulling that needle, apparently. Oh no, they beat us to it. <laughs> no wonder it was so easy, because we got jack shit out of this. Um, I, I guess so, easy come, easy go, man. We had, if we didn't work, if we don't work for it, we don't, we don't deserve the needle then, I guess, right? We didn't do a dungeon. Oh, it was hardly a dungeon. It was like, it was like three screens. So you can't be too sad, right? I mean, the fate of the world is at stake, but you can't be too mad about this. We don't even got to see, we don't even get to see who pulled the needle, man. Who pulled the needle? We're, I'm dying of anticipation. I wonder who it is. Um, anytime now? Oh, it's you! That one guy who's my height. And with the mask, and who apparently looks like me because the commanders mistake them for me. I wonder who you are, Mr. Man. Um, anywho, are we gonna, are we gonna face off with him? Maybe? Now's the time? And look, there's some some, some s mysterious connection between the two. I wonder what that means. What does it mean? Oh no, did you honestly just kill a snowman? That is no good. What is what else? What is also no good is this giant ass monkey thing. That doesn't look pleasant. That doesn't look pleasant at all. You have like cannonballs for hands or something. Should I should I end the part off here? I might just end the part off here, and then we can fight this monkey later, right? Yeah. Okay. So in the next part, we're going to be fighting the Steel Mechorilla. 
But until then, this has been Skid Flash. Hope you enjoyed watching. Bye.